it's nice, but to quote the to quote my fine colleague Mike Peters, the best thing about winning a Pulitzer is not having to worry about winning it. <laughs> that is really true. It's really true. And especially when you work at a paper like the Miami Herald, which has a storied history. And uh, you know, every couple of years, you know, two or three Pulitzers. And uh, people, you know, people were looking and they'd say, you know, what's wrong with this guy, you know? And, 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 it, and it was a lot of pressure. Mm. And uh, I'll tell you the story, actually. It's my, I said to my editor, listen, I, I, I want this to stop. I don't want you to ask me who won it. I don't want any expectations. I want everybody just to leave me alone about this because the fact is it ruins my work for the two months before the Pulitzer's announced to the two months after it's announced. It, it's just be quiet and don't mention it. And so he didn't, which I really liked him for. I mean, he, he was, he was, you know, it's a very nice thing to do. So until he, he said to me in the, and he said, what's, uh, in 1996, he said, so uh, who's winning the Pulitzer this year? And I said, you know, I, t I told you not to ask me that. And he said, I know, I know, I'm sorry about that. He knew that I'd won it when he asked me the question. 